We just seen an application with the TD3, the filtration and heating unit that actually allows us to add heated compressed air and purified air versus regular compressed air. Uh, what we have seen is a base coat with a temperature of 42 degrees, approximately 107 Fahrenheit, and then a clear coat applied at 50 degrees, 120 Fahrenheit. So we see what's the benefits and advantages of using a compressor that is always the same all year long with the same futures or relative humidity down to almost 0% relative humidity and the proper temperature of application. What I noticed the most was is how this one had a better flow out. Uh, you had uh, less orange peel to the surface of it. Uh, the other thing that was unique was uh, how fast it dried in between coats. Uh, being able to put uh, dry air on this one and then when you put the uh, heated dry air on this one flash time was much quicker, so that's faster turnaround that I can see. And less orange peel, less we orange definitely peel. have a more like a mirror finish here. Yep. Already ready for the car to be delivered, let's say. Exactly. No need for polishing or buffing less after that. Less buffing, they have to smooth it out, so. And then we're looking at it, uh, the consumption. Uh, use less base coat, less clear coat. Uh, it seemed to be yeah. on this side versus just a clean, dry air, uh, so. To me, that it, overall, when you're looking at uh, shop use, going with the TD3 unit uh, is a savings uh, and uh, long-term savings because you're not having to buff it or uh, wax it at the same time. Too. The constancy of results, less chance of getting runs or other problems. So yes. it's more that constancy of results and quality of the results and the savings that really makes it for the unit to be a very good investment that pays for itself in a very short period of time. So definitely a shop that invests in the quality of the results or in the efficiency of the process should look at the TD3 technology that is really unique.